what can we do with strings? Uh, we will go over the, the, there's be other video or a lesson that will go over the details of many other functions that you can do with strings but for today i just want to cover about four things that you can do with strings okay where you can add together add strings together number two so this you use addition and this is only in python <laughs> some languages don't allow you to do such things but python has um, think about it as a, an, a way that made it easier for you to just convert the same knowledge you have for adding things uh, using plus and then you can still add uh, the strings together uh, and then you can this is uh, i have only seen this in python actually i don't know if it's in javascript you can actually multiply a string okay using asterisk just as then we multiply with uh, you know, on the numbers asterisk so this will basically will make the will it will uh, what we call replicate or it will repeat the same string n times or the number of the n where n is that number you've put uh, after the asterisk okay and number three you can find the length of a string and here we use a function called len remember we talked about functions you've been seeing print as a function you saw the other function that we did in the in the other class of uh, even now of type so that's just a function just like any other function Functions always have that bracket where you say you put in the stuff that you want the function to, to to work on. And lastly, is getting an item from a string. Get specific item from a string. This is what we call a like in a specific index we call it an index or subscripting but let's just call it index for now okay <laughs> so don't worry if this is becoming intense just take it easy you can pause the video you can do things one at a time but i said from the first class never be in a hurry okay if some, so let's start with adding strings so if i have uh, my first i can have something like first name okay first name equals to daniel and last name equals to baraka okay and then we can put together this first name and second name and last name to make one string by just using plus which is addition so i can have something like first name plus last name but remember the computer does not think that you it will just make a space for you because these are two names the way you write your name you have, if you need a space you have to say okay plus another space okay so I can say first name plus space plus last name. Okay, so you see that's how you can add together. So any string can add together. And you can print now together something like print my name is comma close quotes and comma and then first name plus space last name okay but pipe but the print function i don't know if i should go into this but just for the sake of it okay the print function already puts spaces for you if you put a comma it will that do a space for you what you call a separator if you did a print if you did print here you can see the they're talking about a sep 
the intercepted is already a space so you can actually say something like my name my name is and then just put first name comma last name and it will put the spaces for you but that that's only for the print function that's what it's doing inside that print function it does space for you before it prints out the output okay so that is concatenation or adding together the strings.